starting over. Life has never been this real. So, how are you? Good. Good. How are you doing with your questionnaire? I was confused, but okay. I did the best I could. All right. Miss Niambi is working on a questionnaire that will help her identify the mental, emotional, and behavioral patterns that have been passed on to her from her parents and grandparents. Hi. Hello. I'm How here are to you? see Nambi. I'm Jody. How are you, Jody? How are you? Good. Can Good. I tell her who's calling? Melvin. Okay, Melvin, let me find her for you. Okay. I'm meeting with Niambi today, and we're going to discuss. Uh, family patterns that might exist in her mother and father and within her own life and being able to see the patterns so she's able to um, have an appreciation for how she's learned certain behaviors and characteristics. Not gonna hurt me too bad, are you? <laughs> <laughs> so part of what I'm gonna be doing is I'm going to, uh, you know, homework I sent you? Mm -hmm. We're going to do it all over again. Okay. We're going to put it on the board <laughs> okay. so that we can see some patterns. So just paint this to the top? Yeah. And then we're going to put your mother and then we're going to put your father. Everything that you come up with, I have a sticker. So that way you can see the good things and you can also see the things that are not so pleasant. Okay. See, ultimately what we want to do is we want to make sure that whatever these patterns are that repeat from generation to generation, mm -hmm. let's say that you have kids. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't want to, like, pass those patterns on to them. Correct. So if we can identify them, then we can make some conscious decisions not to do the same thing over and over and over again. Okay. Now, what do you want to say about your mother? Um, she is just whatever needs to get done. She does it. She's very independent. Okay, so let's write down independent. Okay. And resilient. Falls down, gets back up, keeps on ticking. Mm-hmm. Okay. She is closed and defensive. That was one that I recognized from your list. Now, when you say uh, closed, you mean not open to suggestions, ideas, relationship, intimacy? Yeah, her heart is closed to relationships. So her heart is closed. So I mean, not closed-minded, but her heart is closed. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so put down uh, closed heart. But Emotional. she's not very affectionate. Oh, okay. Not very affectionate. To men. That's even better. <laughs> this exercise helps me visualize more clearly some of the patterns that I have been passed down from my parents to myself. Now you're starting to see mm -hmm. a little deeper. The... Mm -hmm. And I'm turning into that. Uh-huh. Really, 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 like, important as far as the quality or characteristic of your father. A negative? Yeah. Well, my dad has been divorced twice and married three times. Okay. So multiple marriages. Okay, let's put that down. Multiple marriages. He was a womanizer. Okay. He was emotionally unavailable, emotional abandonment I have down here. Abandonment? Mm -hmm. Okay, so those are two big ones. Because, you know, if you think about it, you really wouldn't want to have that in your relationship. Mm -mm. Because one of the things that happens is that if he wasn't available, then chances are that you could have relationships where people are not available for you. And I have the current okay. relationship I'm okay. in. Like now, that. remember what I was telling you, German Shepherds don't have poodles. Right. So now you pick up some qualities. Definitely. I mean, there are some things up there that I have to own for myself. It's helpful for me to recognize the patterns because I can be on the lookout for them, and when I do recognize them in myself, I can take the necessary action to make changes. I think that we have uh, done a lot of work in a short amount of time. Mm -hmm. I think so. Yeah, I think uh, you have some more work you can do on your yes, own. Yes, I do. Doing it. So I'm done. Okay. And you get to keep the stickies. I get to keep the stickies too? <laughs> well, you might need them. Yeah, I'm gonna need them. Okay. I am gonna need them.